Hey guys, it's me, Marie Ammerflower, and welcome back to this week's video. So today, we're going to be going um, to do a closet cleanup. I'm the kind of person that just gets like all kinds of stuff from the Star Shape of Christmas things, the events. So I feel like now is a good time between the two holidays, Halloween and Christmas, to, or between Halloween and Christmas, to run through, clean out a whole bunch of stuff, and make my closet a nice space for the future. So let's go clean it up. So this is my home stable. We have a lot of horses in here right now. I don't know what's glitching so bad. It's very laggy. So on the front right here, we have Bramble. This is my um, Winfell. This is Wave. Um, she's my Nixie. There's Chocolate Chip, which I'm writing right now. And then we have um, Wild Spirit, the Yorick Wild Horse from Wild Woods. Sweet Spot, who's my Nap Strepper. I think that's how you say it. Nap, nap Strepper. We have Meteor, who's a Finn Horse. And we have Ember, who's an Umbra. So all of these ones are the ones that are kind of on this side. And then we have a lot more in the back. Most of these are fully trained, such as my Luciano, Cece, my Pentavian, Wimblaze, um, my North Swedish horse, Cherry Cake, my starter horse. And then in the back here, we have a whole bunch of other horses. My Pony, um, Trankner, Jorvik Frisian, Apollosa, North Swedish Room Runner, English Thoroughbred, Solsteed, and Akalteki. And you do not have to remember any of those names. I simply gave them to you because I thought you might like to know. Because sometimes people care about Okay, so we're just gonna ignore that the fact that the clock struck. <laughs> totally ignoring that. Um, yes, I do have a clock in the background. I should have turned it off. Anyway, um, so let's go ahead and get started with this cleanup. Oh, wow. Okay. So, we have a lot of items. For instance, I have been working on the treasure hunting quest, so I have some items from that, such as um, ceramic pieces, sword pieces, um, some little those things um, um we have all these papers these things i don't really i can't really sell recyclables we have a few herbs and then we can have all this random um stuff oh this one needs to be sold okay so this one needs to be sold this is gonna be my soul pile this also needs to be sold like really badly keep like replicating picnic baskets so you could make a whole big bunch of money and i still have um how many is that 20 plus 20. I have 80 of these um, baskets left, so I could technically sell them for a bunch of money, but we don't need to do that because as you can tell, we're just like so rich over here, like just, just looking at that, you know, that's just great. Okay, and then we have some other fruits and vegetables that I'm just gonna ignore. Okay, now clothes. This is where we actually get into the fun. Do you mind? This is where we actually get into the fun part of the organization. So all these shirts to the side, I'm actually really glad they have like the logos on them and stuff. All these ones are a lot of the Jojo Siwa ones. So that definitely dates my account as being very old. Oh, that one can sell for a lot. But a lot of these ones are kind of like the seasonal or ones that you can win from getting something. And then there's a starter one. So a lot of these either you can't sell them or you can't sell them at all. You can't get them again or they were like from a particular season that I really liked. So for instance, the BFF shirt, I rarely ever wear it, but I like it because it's from that particular season, the 2020 um, reward set, which I got. That was before I was a starter. Wow, that was a long time ago. Shirt, I mean, sorry. Cause I'm not really gonna wear it anyways. So I feel like that's probably a good place to start. The rose blouse, however, is a um, quest item. So I'm not gonna sell that one. And this one I feel like was also a quest item. I don't know for sure though. So I feel like I'm gonna hang on to that one too because I don't really remember. Okay, so this shirt, I think I bought it um, because I don't really know where it would have come from otherwise. But I don't feel like I'm gonna get rid of it because it looks like it was it cost a reasonable amount. Now this one, okay, this one has a lot of memories. This one is one of my first shirts that I wore this one. So I think I'm gonna get rid of this one. It was, it's worth so little. Oh, it's worth very little to me. Like I actually don't really care. Okay, so there's that one. Oh, this one also has a lot of memories. I think this one's also from Fort Pinta. 
but I just can't get rid of it because of like the sentimental value behind it. Festival was it? I think it was around the Midsummer Festival because I do have like an old music video of me um, wearing it. Let me see if I can pop that up right here for you. Yeah, so this shirt is from that. I don't like this shirt, but also I can't get it back if I sell it. And I do have some good, you know, questing memories with it. So, one second. That was a phone that went off. Um, so sorry about that. Just ignore that. This is so cute, but I never wear it. Same thing with this one. A lot of these I kind of find cute. You think my sense of fashion is weird? That's because it is. Okay, so we got rid of two shirts. Dresses. So I am not a dress person. Now this looks like I am a dress person, but that's because I have so many dresses from like events because I'm the kind of person that will be like, oh, this dress is cute. And then I won't do anything with it. A lot of these are like New Year's dresses or Christmas dresses. So I really can't get rid of many of them. Okay, but the Valentine's Day dresses, I think are gonna go. So this one, this one's actually kind of cute. So I'm gonna keep that one, but I'm gonna let go of the other one. That's a Christmas one. This dress is the dress that you get um, when James gives you a present after like the missions where you open, when you open the Yorvik City Mall and you go, it's, this is the dress that you get from those missions. So this is probably one of the only pieces of starter clothing that I have left after like four years, which is really cool because I like forget that I have this dress. I think this one's also from um, a mission or something. You know, I'm just gonna say anything about this one though. This one I love so much. I actually really love this dress and I haven't ever worn it. Okay, as you can tell, this page is a... So this page is all of my long sleeves and a couple of these things, for instance, this one and this one, I have tried to get rid of so many times but they won't sink and sell. So I feel like I almost have to keep them because if they're not gonna sell, what am I gonna do with them? This one has so many good memories but I also feel like I just don't wear it much. Like this one I bought as like an entire set with a blue and yellow outfit. And I'm definitely gonna wear that sometime, probably around Christmas time or maybe in the next couple videos, who knows? So um, we will probably um, hang on to this one too. So this sweater, again, it, this one's from Wolfhall Inn. See, when, you, when I can tell you where it's from, that means that I really care about like the memories behind whatever sweater this is. So this one's from Wolf Paul Inn and it is really cute. I could also just buy it again. I've had it for probably multiple years ever since I opened Wolf Paul Inn. In, um, my goal in the past was to get like one piece of clothing from every single location. So I could just wear whatever piece of clothing I wanted and be like, oh, look at me. I'm so cute in my piece of clothing, you know? Totally not. <laughs> anyway, so I think it's time to let this thing go. Okay, so this riding waistcoat has had a lot of good memories as well for me. This one I got, um, I feel like it might have been my first star coin set. So I think we're gonna let it go, which is really, it doesn't want to let me go. And then these two, whoa. That is expensive. This one's a no, just no, go away. Oh my goodness. This shirt is the only shirt that I, or not the only shirt. This shirt is one of the shirts that I have from Silver Glade Manor itself. I got it because I thought it would look cute on her and I'm gonna keep it because I'm an idiot. Okay, next page. So this is where I've got my champ clothes over here. All right. Pants time. I'm gonna leave my summer clothes page alone. It's the last page of my clothes. So we're gonna leave that page alone. When you realize you spent a half an hour looking at shirts. Yeah. So on the pants page, we're gonna go a little bit quicker and just run through everything. Why do I have Cantarella's pantaloons? Okay, we have way too, oh my goodness. What's even going on? I don't know. The thing is, I think if I, even if I didn't buy these pants, well, the thing is I don't really wear this kind of pants. So I think we're gonna get rid of those ones too. Okie dokie, on to the hats. I actually don't even think I wanna go through all of these hats because I have so many hats. Okay, no, honey, that is not even, why do I have so many starter helmets? What is going on? I thought I was like 
some sort of big wig starter and then I look at my helmets and I have starter helmets. Like what is wrong with you? Uh, no. This flower hat needs to go out of here. And actually, oh, the, pump, the pumpkin one has a funny story behind it, but I'm not gonna tell it to you guys right now. Glove wise, I think we're gonna leave all of my gloves as they are. I don't, wait, why do I have two pairs of white gloves? We have too many of these like brown colored boots. So I'm gonna get rid of those ones. Why do I have so many pairs of white boots? What? Okay, I have like four pairs of white boots. We do not need four pairs of white boots. If you ever say, you know, you need four pairs of white boots, come by my closet and grab one, please. I have too many. So these sneakers I did spend money on, but you know what? I have too many pairs of sneakers. I just do. We don't need any more pairs of sneakers in our closet. Like, what are you doing, honey? Get your act together and stop buying sneakers. I have not worn these boots since Christmas. Am I gonna get rid of them? No, because I don't have room in my backpack to store them. Excuses. Okay, so that's all the clothes. So I think we're actually gonna go ahead and do a quick little soul spree. All of my memories in the garbage. In the garbage. Okie dokie, now it's time for the horse section of Okay, I've never worn this saddle. I know it's a quest item, but no. Here's the saddle from that set I was telling you about, like with the, the blue and yellow. This is the saddle from that set. So I have found um, eight culprits of bad saddles that I'm not gonna wear. Now let's go look at the saddle pads. I'm just looking through all of these and noting um, multiple ones that I really should have gotten rid of a long time ago. For instance, this one, I used to wear this as a starter. Like, what am I doing with this stuff in my closet? <laughs> who am I? Who is this person who does wear all of these strange things? I'm also noticing how many of the same saddle pad I have. Okay, that was much faster than the other one. Um, I think the bridles, I'm actually going to leave all of them because I, I can't even find my bridles in the first place, so I don't feel like I need to go through them. Leg wraps, though. This is going to be interesting. Because I think a couple of these I should be able to get rid of. If they request item or not, okay. Do I have other green? Yes, I have other green ones. Then we don't need these green ones. These ones are from the green Nauta set that we got so long ago. Okay, no. Capricious Carnival, no. I have two pairs of red leg wraps. I'm gonna sell the more expensive ones. I don't like this. I cannot with this. Come on, mouse, work with me here. Okay, saddlebag wise, I think we use just about all of these. Pretty much indestructible. <laughs> I cannot. Oh my goodness. Did I get. Oh. Whoa! Okay. And this is where everything else is that I <clears throat> am definitely not going to get rid of right now. So we're going to just ignore that whole page. Okay, so we just completed the entire closet cleanup. We all give ourselves a round of applause. Yes, I am so good at this. Now I'm gonna go sell all of these things and probably go beyond my JS limit. And then we're gonna buy new things, or at least one new thing. And then I'm gonna celebrate the fact that I'm done with this um, closet cleaning by logging off of Star Stable finally. Global store! This is my friend now. This is my life that we live, where we go to the global store. Let, let's try to get a new sweater, how about that? I need help, guys. Please, somebody send... What is this one? Wee, this is cute! Hold up, hold up, hold up. That's actually stinking cute, and I want it. Sell, 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 now, sell, oh my goodness, sell, please, I need that jacket, I mean, I don't need it, but I want it so bad, okay, I think we have enough to do that now, we're gonna just sell like two or three more things to pull up my price a little bit more. Where did you go, my friend? There you are. My new jacket, yay! I'm gonna be so fashionable now. Did I just buy that with star coins? 
I did not just do that. I just did that. I just... Why you let me down like this? I'm so ugh. Star stable. Star stable. Star stable. Okay, well let's buy something else not with star coins. I'm probably gonna get rid of those in like not very long after, but I'm just so annoyed. I don't even care. Like I literally don't even care. Okay, don't care you guys, that's gonna be so that's going to be it for this week's video. I hope you all enjoyed me um, clean, trying to clean out my closet and then getting annoyed at the buttons when they didn't press and then buying something with star coins when I meant to buy it with your shillings. Make sure you guys like, make sure you guys subscribe, and make sure you click that notification bell so you can be notified whenever I post one of my new videos. That's going to be it for this week's video. My name is Maria Flower. Thank you guys so much for watching. See ya!